2005 Cimarron North Star. Uh, one owner, we bought it brand new, ordered it special um, as a living quarter shell so that we can install a uh, weekender of type uh, package. Um, it is an eight foot wide, does have a hydraulic jack, brand new spare, meaning it's never been used. It still has the tag on the rubber. Um, 16 foot awning, uh, stainless wheel simulators, drop down windows on the butt side. Drop down also on the uh, rear door. Drop downs on the head side, escape door with two mangers on the side. Stainless steel front end. Recessed exterior load lights. Three adjustable saddle racks with blanket bars, bridle hooks, Some more bridle hooks on the inside, and uh, brush box. Yeah, rear tack and it's, it's collapsible. Everything works. Inside has Two mangers. Nice easy slam latches. Stud divider on the first stall. Manger in the second stall as well. Insulated roof with three vents. Three recessed lights. Cimarron does a really nice job of insulating the trailers. It's, uh, it stays cooler in here in the summertime and warmer in the winter. It's kind of nice. This is the walkthrough door into our living quarters. You'll see it's got cabinets on the butt side, upper and lower, with a uh, uh, pretty good size window. It also has the camper um, screen door. Wood trim all the way around. Wooden bulkhead um, for blanket storage. And a pair of bunk beds. The walls and ceiling are made. We, we got materials from a uh, horse trailer interior conversion company. Um, it looked a little nicer than what we could have just gone and got at Lowe's or whatever. We insulated all the sides with uh, half inch insulation and the ceilings with one inch insulation. The cabinets were actually made by a uh, professional cabinet maker here in Holmes County. Uh, it's a solid oak. None of it is laminated or anything. They're real oak and they're just nice storage obviously for when you go camping or whatever the floor is uh, wooden laminate but uh, um, the bed is also the bunk bed is uh, uh, oak made out of uh, I got it from a lumber yard here in Holmes County, actually. Uh, nice thing about the bunk bed, though, is the bunk bed is only attached by about two or three spots, so the whole bunk can be removed, and then you would have the entire regular living quarters. If you didn't want the bunk, uh, we take our kids, had mattresses custom made for this size, um, which is just shy of six feet. Uh, 
when the kids don't go with us, we use it to store our bags and stuff. So it's been nice for us. But uh, I'll take another walk around. I'm posting the video just because pictures can only do it anything so much. Let's give you a little better idea of what the trailer is. Of course, if you have any questions or want any additional photos of anything else in particular, please don't hesitate to contact me. It's been a great trailer and uh, we wouldn't be getting rid of it right now, except that our sun has started riding now as well so there's four of us instead of three so we're going to be uh, getting a four horse trailer so thank you so much for your time